One of Australia's most popular cartoonists drawing fire from the world's most popular author. Well done on reducing one of the greatest sports women alive to racist and sexist tropes. To have JK Rowling trolling me is, well, it's something I didn't expect in life. The Harry Potter writer, just one of thousands who've taken to social media condemning this depiction of Serena Williams at the US Open, a reaction the cartoonist didn't anticipate. One of the greatest players of all time, who I have admired and drawn many times, uh, having a dummy spit. Uh, and I can say that when I drew the cartoon, it was like, yeah, that's not bad, and off it went. The US Association of Black Journalists referenced a racist past when it called it a repugnant cartoon which exudes racist and sexist caricatures of both women, but Williams' depiction is unnecessarily Sambo-like. Her facial expressions are one of somebody having a dummy spit. Uh, I don't know how I could have done it any other way. I support him on it, it's a great cartoon and I don't think there's any racism there at all. Do you think that's racist? Oh, well, you know... You don't like it, obviously. I don't like the look of it, but, um, you know, I'm not going to call him a racist, but I don't like the look of it. Mark Knight has the support of his News Corp chiefs who've dismissed the online attacks. In this world of perpetual outrage where people are looking for victimhood, um, nothing surprises me. The daughter of civil rights activist Martin Luther King called that response unfortunate, without consideration for the painful historical context of such imagery. Look, I'd say in my defence, um, I've done... I, I'm not a racist. <laughs> uh, I've done cartoons uh, supporting Adam Goods in his uh, booing situation. As Mark Knight goes back to the drawing board, he says he won't be referencing himself in tomorrow's cartoon but he may rethink just what he depicts in future drawings. And not just because of the response he's been getting. My family are, uh, are worried and upset at the threats that, that we're getting. Um, is it going to affect me in the future? Maybe it will. Maybe, maybe I will have to pull my punches. He'll leave the last word to his famous cartoon pig. What have you gone and done now? Brett McLeod, Nine News.